with another it's banger. Today's episode, I'm back at Blanchard Skate Park with the homies going in. Now, y'all know I tore my meniscus like two weeks ago. They were saying it was going to be six months to heal, but I mean, let's go. <laughs> Bruh. One week ago, I couldn't even walk. I told God I was skating no matter what. I went to that tennis court with my crutches, push switch with tears almost in my eyes because of the pain, my knee constantly dislocating. And I said in the video, I'm skating by faith. If God heal me, he gonna heal me. If he don't, I'm gonna skate until I fall apart. And out of nowhere, I, I just got, after I skated one time, I got 10 times better. The second time, 10 times better. Now this is the third time and I got one more after this, um, which will be the part two of this video. It is Jesus. nuts. I'm not going to spoil it. I'm going to just say one of the tricks. I did a front nose pop out on a waist high uh, drop over a gap. It is mean looking too, y'all. So y'all stay tuned for the next video because it's nuts. I also learned like four more tricks. All of them bangers too. Right here, I'm just warming up on the uh, fakey ollies. Just trying to get my uh, my knees warmed up and ready. James, look out. James. Now I'm coming down James. over this so I can, um, I'm trying to do a little air over the little hip here. Still just warming up. Got smacked. My wife is super concerned and I would be too, man, cause you know, I do got some things going on. But I ran it back. Let's get it. All right, right here. Let's go over the hip. And y'all know my pop is way higher than that, man, but I rehab it. Now, I don't know homie's name right here, but uh, he definitely did a sick heel flip in this video. Y'all gonna see it coming up. Um, and at the end, I know y'all ain't seen it in a while, but your boy about to go savage mode at the end. I'm warming up on my manuals for the trick I'm gonna do at the end, but I gotta get in that mode first. Oh yeah, bro, hit the big 50, let's go. So during the two weeks when I really couldn't skate, I had like two days where I did skate. And during that time, I learned how to ride switch. So all this is switch. Switch kick turns. I learned all this in like a day. This is what happens when, you, when I can't skate. I just start learning other stuff. But now I got like switch on the ramp crazy. So y'all gonna see something come out of that real soon. Watch this. Ooh. Bro, try heel flip front 50, bro. That's crazy. He almost went in a heel flip front board. But did he low key sack? Not sack, but uh, he didn't want to run that back and I don't blame him. Then Jace the Ripper with the 180, then the fakey front big spin. All right, I think he about to run that thing back just to uh, wipe him down a little bit, clean him up. Let me see if he got him. Let's go, Jace the Ripper, slash. Alright, now let me go ahead and uh, hit him with the fakey front 180. Just warming up. Alright, I ain't getting no pop on that, so let me just run the fakey Ollie back just to get the timing of the pop again. Alright, yes sir. Let's get it. Alright, now I'm about to run it back real quick. I just got a pop a little bit earlier. Still missed it. Yo, I love carving around this front side though, man. I'm just getting my little ollies Woo! back, getting my little knees up under me. Almost ran my daughter over. Oh, bro, nice! got the kick flips over the hip. Almost had it. That actually inspired me, man. On this part two, man, y'all gonna see me uh, nice! learn or not learn kick flip the piggy on the uh, quarter pipe. And that'd be beast. If I do it, you never know. Gotta watch part two to find out. up with the fakie ollie but i'm really trying to get a, a real clean uh fakie Whoa. front side half cap up out of there <laughs> gotta warm those knees up y'all telling you man they creaking but they're getting there all right right here you can tell the boy was in the boat that was like that was a uh, old school
school savage right there. Alright. I'm gonna snap this one. Did anybody hear that? Hold up. Let's go, boy. That was clean. Woo! The savage is back. Skate park was low key jack today, man. Hey, I'm riding switch, kick, switch kick turns, coming over the hump, and then going into tail stall, and then taking it back. Watch out, hun. Going to fakey, like yo, I'm just riding around in every stance now. So like, that's one thing out of being hurt. I got fakey Ollie over there. Let's go. It's just rolling around switch, even on ramps. Let's get it. A little small one over the hip. I couldn't go crazy because of my knee, but I got a little something, something. Bro, he got this right here. Let's go. I'm telling you, this is the dude that can. Um, he actually taught me. Uh, I don't want to talk about it, but yeah. I got a crazy trick over that hip. It's going to be in part two. But yeah, seeing yeah. him do that inspired me to learn kick flip the fakies, which I may or may not have learned in part two. There's <laughs> a lot of may or may not. All right, Let's this go. is it right here, bro. You basically got All right, it. My dog right here was trying yeah. to get the heel flip. That'd be mean too, boy. It made me mad that my knee was hurting, y'all. That's why I was filming, because I, I was getting too tempted. To really start going crazy over this uh, Euro. Let's get, Let's get it. The heel flip. I had to hit y'all with the slow mo. Let's Look get, at that catch. Alright. Riding down fakey. See all that switch riding got me good out here. There we go. I'm going to get him higher. Y'all wait till this knee. Wait till this knee get right, man. That two or three days of really not being able to, uh, that not being able to skate where I had to ride switch really helped me. Now I want a manual over that, and then pop up here manual across that, and then pop in. Cause y'all know I just learned manuals maybe like four days ago. So I'm trying to get it over that hip. It's scary over the bigger hip because if you mess up, it's steep and you just slam going way down there. But, yo, y'all wait till the end of the time. video because uh, I might get savage. All right. I, uh, one last try on the manual. Hun. No, no, all right. I'm not messing with that, but the manual, I got to try one. I know my wife wants to stop me bad, but she know I, she can't because I'm about to be in savage mode. She can literally see the savage in my eye. Like, I can taste it. Like, I know when I'm, she know when I'm there, too. Now, mind you, two days before this, I could not manual three inches without stopping. For real. Now, I almost had it, but I tapped right there. As I came out of that, I thought about the torn meniscus injury and how it tried to take me down. I thought about what the doctor said about how I wouldn't walk for the next eight months. I heard the voices of all the subscribers who hit me up in the comments to encourage me and tell me to get up from where I was at. And it snapped me into savage mode. Savage mode. Engage. Everything I've been through in the last three weeks come down to this moment. Can I do this? It'll be proof that the miracle has happened. Let's go. Stop playing, bro. Yo, hit that like button right now. Boy, listen. All the savages, bro, put nothing is impossible in the comments. This is two weeks and some change after I was told it would be six to eight months before I'll be walking around normal again or skating. And or I would have yeah. to have surgery and it would probably be around somewhere around that same time. But I'm going to show you what trusting God for the impossible looks like. Preview of the next video. Next. Is one thing to hide.
could really bring me back from out of nowhere. When the doctors told me it'd be eight months, and within two weeks that I'm almost fully recovered. All right, y'all, I'm losing composure because y'all just don't know. I was getting depressed. I was going through some things and I really just stood in faith. And I remember after two weeks going to the doctor and they, and they told me that it was torn and, I, and then how long it would be. And after two weeks of staying in the house, it didn't get better. I got on one day and I got on a tennis court and I said, you know what? I don't care what happens. I'm just going to trust God and I'm going to just stand in faith that faith without works is dead. Meaning you can have faith, but you got to step out and do something. I got on my board and I pushed and I pushed and it hurt. Um, but after, as I continued that day, my leg had never felt better by the end of that day. I might have been five to ten times better. I couldn't believe it. Better than the whole two weeks when I sat there with the medicine. I said in that video, I'm standing in faith in God. I waited two days, went out again. I was hurting all that time. I skated. After I skated, 10 times better. Then the next day was this last video. 10 times better. I was flying around ramps. My knee is not dislocated. I thank you, Jesus. Like, y'all don't know. Those who pray for me, this is a miracle. I don't care what you... Listen, I'm telling you, days ago, I could not walk. My knee would dislocate every step I would take. I'm telling you this as a fact. I can show y'all the doctor's report. Yeah, this this next video, when I, I'm telling you, bruh, I was doing everything. I didn't feel nothing going on with my knee. It was insane. I mean, I landed a front nose pop out that was so insane. Y'all gonna see on this video coming up. And I'm sorry y'all getting emotional. Y'all y'all just don't even know. <laughs> y'all don't know what I've been through and in the, in the different things with this, but, and not even just this. Um, but thank y'all for supporting me. Thank y'all for those who prayed for me, those who stood with me, those who encouraged me, because your words helped me get up and be who the savage that I'm supposed to be, bro. Instead of just getting down and getting depressed and getting you know what i mean you never know what your words mean man so thank you for your comments thank you for those who have subscribed thank you for those who like the videos man i appreciate your support man watch the new videos check out that playlist savage life